So, a week or so ago, I picked up these Emerson Research Auto Set digital clocks. Um, so, but the uh, digital set, the auto set part will be useless if the battery is wasted, which in both these units it is. Um, so, I was recently using this one and I moved it from one part of the room to the other and it still managed to set itself even with the battery indicator being low. So there was just enough juice in the battery left to do that. But it's been off for a while so the battery may have run pretty dry again. Anyway, um, this one, there's a segment that doesn't light up on the last, the furthest to the right digit. Uh, so I don't know what's up with that. I'm not going to figure out what's loose or if it's burned out or what, but I'm going to plug both of them in. Well, even though it shows the low battery, it still set itself to the proper time. So there was still a little juice in that battery left. Now I'm going to plug the other one in, which I know probably won't have the proper backup. Nope. Yeah, see? That one... Yeah. Anyway, as you can see, this segment is not lit. Doesn't matter what I do. Anyway, uh, let's go with this one first. This one is model number CKS1850. And I'm trying to see if there's actual man a manufacturer date on it. I don't see one. But obviously it's like probably late 2000s and early, yeah. I'm around there, I'm sure. Anyway, uh, I'm on the whole widescreen angle with my phone and it doesn't focus when recording. So you'll see it, but it'll be a little blurry. But you got the radio on off, you got the alarm one and two, alarm mode for radio or buzzer, sleep, the month, the date, the time, both those buttons do the year, time zone, and then you're up and down. And then you got your tuning, your band, and your volume. Your dimmer control, all on one and two. And then, oh, buzzer radio. Buzzer radio, so that alarm mode up there. I'm not sure what that does, actually, because I've never used it. <laughs> anyway, um, since this one's already set, um, I'm not going to really set it again, but I can still tell you pretty much how to. Uh, for the month and date, you would just hold down the month and date button and then use the up or down arrows to set the month and date. And same thing for the time. For the year, you would hold down both and change the year. And then it should stay like that, so every time you plug it in, as long as the battery is not dead, it will set itself. Now, I don't know what alarm mode does. I've never used it, but there's the sleep, and I'm not focusing on, I'm not tuning in on any stations. I, I really got the feeling uh, in just talking about a couple of things that they are so, um, I mean, they're, they're battling the taxes, they're battling uh, impeachment, they're battling the Russia. So that would be the snooze, I mean the uh, sleep, no, yeah, sleep. And that will be the snooze, but that's for when the alarm goes off. Now, if I have alarm one on for whatever reason, I don't know what that alarm mode button does. I actually have the manual still. I'd actually have to look at that. Give me a second. Okay, so it says here that the alarm mode button is for week, days, weekends, everyday alarm button. So that's what that does. Okay, so... uh. So that would be alarm one is eight. Oh, I see. So it's set for every day of the week. So I bet you if I do this, ah, see, I'm still learning something new. <laughs> That's what that does. And obviously if you hold it down and use the arrows, you can set it. So that's what that does. Okay. And that's pretty much it. I'm not going to really use the radio. It's pretty crappy, but um, actually, Let's see, alarm one, radio or buzzer. I've never actually used the alarms, nor do I 
use radio or buzzer with the alarm. So I'm going to actually set it for, let's see. Let's see if I can make it to 920. Okay, I guess we'll see if it actually does anything. And it's set for every day of the week, so it will go off either way. I wonder how loud it actually gets. Sorry if you guys sorry if I'm making you guys wait a little bit. Okay, so that's what that one does. Cool. Even though I don't use alarms. So that's that that's one clock. Uh, switch this around. And then the other one's pretty much the same thing. This one has got the low battery indicator. This one, this one flashes. The other one is a steady on. And yeah. Wow, this one's a little bit bulkier. Month, date, time, both buttons is the year, your time zone. Alarm one, two, alarm mode, down and up and set. So, this one's not set, so if I hold down month and date, I can set that. One, two, three, what is it? The 8th of October? See, I thought that was a nine, it's actually an eight. <laughs> um... Oh yeah, that's right. You actually have to go through the entire cycle. You can't do the day and then the date. And these buttons are a little touchy. Both I paid both these up at a local thrift store for four bucks each. I wonder if that's the eight. Nope, that was the nine, so that's the eight. So yeah, that would be that. And both buttons would be the year. Then you just do the directionals. So touch those buttons are hard to use. I'm not even gonna bother with the time. This is just for demonstration. Uh, the time zone. It's right now it's set for two, which is typical for the eastern U.S. And then doing that will advance the clock. Twelve, one, yeah. Same with this one. I didn't show that on this one. Time zone, two. So. Default is two for this area. Uh, yeah, so and the radio on this one doesn't. Radio on this one's pretty crappy too. This one you got volume, volume, AM, FM, tuning, alarm one, two, and then the dimmer, high and low. This one's already set for high. This one is not as bright as the other one. Although the camera makes it look bright. Um, Building stamp for the president. Foy and MMG can also cover recreational vehicles. Or so yeah, I'm not gonna do the alarm because I'm assuming it's the same exact thing. But yeah, um, this one model number, model number CKS three zero four eight. And then obviously for the alarm, you would do the same thing. You'd hold the alarm button down, and then you use the up or down to set it. And then the alarm mode, so it's all week, just the week, weekends, and all week. So that's pretty much it with these little clock radios. All right, later.